Welcome everyone to the first part of this tutorial. In this part, we will learn how to import our references images into Maya. First thing, you have to know the unit you want to work with and adjust your reference images to that unit so you can easily import it into Maya. In my case, I'm going to use centimeter and adjust my photo reference size height and width to 15 centimeters. We can change the unit in Maya by going to Windows, Settings, Preferences, then go to the Preferences and then Setting and then we choose the working unit, either centimeters, meter, whatever you are comfortable to work with. Now let's start import our references images. First we have to choose the view that we want to import the reference into it. So I'm going to choose the front view by, click, by clicking the space bar. Then we go to the polygon bar and choose the plan shape by clicking and dragging Then we go to the channel box and choose Imports, Polyplan 1, we change the width to 15 cm and height to 15 cm as we choose the size for our references images. Now we will import our reference images by going to the render bar, then choosing the Lambert picturing, and then choosing the Lambert tag from the attribute editor, and by clicking the tag beside the color, we choose file, and then go to the folder source and then we choose the front side images from our reference. Now we click W to choose the move tool and move our reference images to the X axis and align the end of it to the y-axis. We click the space bar to switch to the perspective view. Then we choose the z-axis to drag it backward. This action will be repeated to all view you want to assign a reference image to help with your modeling. In this case, since the character is symbol, we will just import a front reference image for the front view and a side reference image for the side view. So we're gonna speed this a little bit. We can rotate the perspective view by clicking Alt plus clicking on the left mouse button and drag it left or right, up or down to determine the rotation of the view. 
click out and the middle button in the mouse to zoom in or out. Now go to file to save, save scene as, choose a folder, name your file and then save it. 